Mets are on losing. They had a good season this uh, year. Na ang laki talaga ng improvement compared to the last season. Na maraming games na halos na nanalo sila. It's just talaga medyo kulang talaga lang sila sa personnel. Uh, especially also with the entry of Paulo Hubalde, who of course, you know, he's not anymore like his past self where he used to be a fast point guard. Paolo likes to set up the offense and really dictate the pace of the game. Oh, oh. And uh, against the Amos SB squad, played 19 minutes. Offensive rebound by Ray Baltazar. Montero finds himself wide open. That's another three. Actually, I, I believe it's more than four teams that you could consider superior here in our league. Oh, oh. and uh, ang pinag-uusapan natin dito, Javi, in both divisions. Up before, up for, up for in the in the Baliwag Star Coliseum. Alam mo yun, kitang it so it was going to be a promising season for them. But this guy, as the season pro, he has definitely shown so much promise. It's a zero del Vigan, and when he gets hot, he really sizzles for the disciplinados. So does that guy, Jeremy Cruz. Uh -huh. uh, you know, I kind of feel bad for Jeb because I feel bad that you know his team didn't follow suit. Uh -huh. And then uh, if you look at the three-point shooting, two out of six for the Bulacan Kuyas, and four out of seven, man, para dito sa that makes it three. Three pointers late. Alam mo naman yung second and third game natin come from behind naman. Quite a story there in Palayan City. I actually thought that Pasig was well on their way to a. And this scoring inside. Miranda grabbing that rebound. Santa Maria gives it back. Miranda, the pass out. Another former JRU heavy bomber, Tete Tedoro, kissing the arrows to the sky. That's a three point. Piansa niya. Obalde trying to use his experience at the post against Ingel Tedoro. Does the same basket and won the bang and the bucket para kay Tete Tedoro. Oh, and talking about an important thing, important thing. Right after that, they close out the season against Valenzuela in Laguna. Baltazar ahead of the pack. Baltazar will score. That's fast. Baltazar got hit. No whistle blown. Arce. Gets it to the Flores, but they will run out of time there, and that is going to be it. Baldeg, a screen from Baltazar. First yeah. quarter kill goes story right there, coach. Uh oh, four out of 16 at 25 percent. Etong etong kuya si ah. Ito namang Mindoro is uh, eight uh, out of 21. Pero to convert eight of those 11 charities. 72% clip from the line. Ruff Flores being aggressive once again for Bulacan. And he gets the hook shot to go. Six po naman itong uh, taong. So talagang sigurado, sigurado nasa first ng list ni Coach Bud Reyes to na kilalang. Ito kasi kung may kilala si Coach Bud Reyes na player dito. Sa the rebound goes to Ken Arce. Uh, imagine itong backward combination right now ng disiplinados. No? What a fit. Six minutes and 37 remaining here in the first half. Alcoriza leading all scorers so far in this game with nine points. Lobalde with a rock. That's a screen from Hernandez. Hubalde, rare attempt, gets it to go. That was all net coming from Paulo Hubalde. Uh oh, much needed. This coming into his game shape, his old form. Is it start the season? Para nang nga pa talaga siya. Uh oh, and uh. Especially, kanina nga, gusto kong... Dangerous pass. Camacho recovers by Gunn. Great passing there. Leaves it for Cristal Hernandez. So what about the development of Cristal Hernandez this season, coach? Oh, number one, I think minus 20 pounds or 25 pounds. Tama ka dyan, actually. That's a good observation. But Jim Cruz, right there to get two points once... Uh, na isin na minensyon ni uh, Coach Padre yes. malaking bagay yun for Christian kasi comfortable siya playing uh, with team sa tutelage ni Coach attacks middle the kick out Ako for three as long Sebastian gets the rebound another power play right eh. itong uh, Bulacan Kuyas na natira yeah that's correct after nine in that five spot they're trying to set up Tete Tedoro here. Good denial by Bulacan. Kubalde passes it out. They get to the corner. Tedoro from downtown. 
Alcoriza speeding. No foul called. Alcoriza is down. Miranda, bounce pass, Vaigan. That's an easy deuce para kay Rodel Vaigan. So let's speed up the pace. Well, except now for this possession by Bulacan where they'll try to go for the last shot. My mistake, no. Reds Alcoriza actually hoists up a three-pointer there to tie this at 41-all. Uh -oh. It's a referee to wake your players up or to make a point na because of consistent calls. So, pero misan tinatay. Parang merong, merong one or two three-pointers to every game. Eh. The squad. At ang uh, Paulo Obalde, yung mga, yung mga pro, nung front line nila. Shot clock winding down here for the Kuyas. Backdoor, Ingel Guevara to beat the buzzer, and he does! First taste of the lead since the first quarter for the Bulacan Kuyas, 48 to 46. This is also their biggest lead of the game. Jimenez couldn't dial it down from the outside. Hernandez, tough worker on the glass today, finally gets one through. Uh, a second offensive rebound between Christian Hernandez in this second half. Hernandez already with 10 rebounds in this game to go with his six points. Cruz. That is such a pretty looking jumper. You know, the best game of Jeremy Cruz this season was Dada. Couldn't get it from downtown. Jimenez on the follow, could not score as well. Miguel pushing, leaves it. Guevara, push shot, no good. Rob Flores is there, kissing it off. A lot of things in terms of being a guard. Pero nagpapasalamat daw siya sa kanyang minamahal na si Coach Luis Gonzalez. Kasi ang pangarap daw talaga niya ay makalaban si Encho Serrano. At buti daw, aabutan pa niya ito next game against Pampanga. Have you, Coach Louis? Oh, thank you so much, Mika. He's really been getting a lot of good experience here, Coach, playing against grown men. That's why I'm very excited. Passes it, Vaigan gets past the defense. That Ooh. should be called tending. Adjusts, could not score. Quickly the other way. Kapulo, Pinoy step, that's token defense. Missing on the second free throw was Ken Arce. AJ Miranda, this is a guy who can also create shots. Not just for his teammates, but for himself as well. Coach, and uh, you know, sino yung long time coach dyan sa PSBA? Sino ko? Si Coach Philip Cesar. Oh, the king of Tapal, ah? Oh, oh Tapal King. <laughs> But Bulacan will retain possession with 1.7 seconds remaining. Yeah, in insert na ni Coach uh, Balz itong si Camacho to give itong si Tete a breather. Turn around jumper by Ken. By Bomber is also Saret with 89. Oh, and then that, you know, that record, quadruple, that's a quadruple double. <laughs> Toma, yeah, Coach, I remember. Active losing streak at 12 games. But even if that is the case, they're number 12 in the Northern Division. But so is Mindoro, who is number 12 in the South, as Adrian Miranda able to uh, Jeremy uh, Cruz. Because, you know, it's hard to na start tayo malakas. Eh. Tapos we end up tayong na wala na yung galing yung sigla, yung galing at sigla natin. Cruz blocked by Hernandez. Capulo recovers, shot clock did not reset for Bulacan. 75 to 64. Guevara now. Back to Fabian. Jeric has been a non factor here in this Ooh. game. But good dish out to Jordan Engel who finished. Lead us down to single digits, 75 to 66. Miranda pulls up, pretty looking jumper. Karakaeja Miranda. Spot in their respective divisions. At Bulacan holding a 12 game losing streak, while Leto Mandoro hasn't won in six games. AJ Miranda, though, looking to change that here today para sa kanyang kumunan. Yeah, the third. He went off to such a good start. That basket looked very wide for him in the first half. Rob Flores trying to take the cudgels now for Bulacan. That's a crucial basket para sa Jeric Fabian. Jimenez. Want an isolation against Cruz Jimenez? The fall away jumper is good. Para kay Marvel Jimenez. Oh, and Can doesn't get a stop here. This could be over. 
Ubalde. Quick pass to the corner. Back to Paolo. The Aquaman. Drops it off to the baseline. Miranda. Floater is good. Well, what a second half for AJ Miranda. Gets the offensive rebound. Right after this, we will be seeing the Quezon City Todak Sean B. Fresh squaring off against the Kalokan. Uh, okay, mal think that's it. Uh, Makati was able to beat Pampanga. Just a slim margin, but yung laban ng Paranaque against Marikina, uh, that was a bad game. Oh, oh. They, uh, itong si Christian Hernandez at itong si John Baltazar. Double-double efforts para dun sa parehong players that you just mentioned. Our best player of the game, AJ Miranda, is with Mika Bisamis. AJ, 19 points left.